Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Young Money Investing, where we help everybody, no matter how young or how old, achieve true wealth in their lives. Today I'm doing something just a little bit different. I'm starting a new video review series where I'll take a look at a stock and decide whether or not it's overvalued or undervalued. Now this is important to know this is not financial advice and I am not issuing buy or sell recommendations. This is simply my personal opinion on a given stock and you should always, always, always do your own research before deciding which investments are right for you. If you would like to sit down with a licensed financial consultant and discuss your financial future, I'll leave a link down below in the description. Ready? Let's go. So basically how this will work is we'll look at a company's fundamentals and chart in order to get a complete overview of it. If you didn't already know, I am a proponent of both fundamental and technical analysis, so we'll be using both to decide whether or not I think it's a good time to buy the stock. Speaking of, let's get into the focus of today's video. Now in honor of Valentine's Day being on Monday, I thought it would be fun to review Match Group Incorporated, ticker symbol MTCH. Match Group is in the internet dating business and they are traded on the NASDAQ exchange. They operate a global portfolio of over 40 internet dating apps, including Tinder, Match.com, and OkCupid. Let's dive in. Now I'll start on the fundamental side, and as you can see, I'm using Yahoo Finance to get a broad overview of the company. Match has a market cap of just about $32 billion. They have earnings per share of 93 cents and a PE ratio or price to earnings ratio of 121.38. Now, right off the bat, a P.E. ratio of 121 seems extremely high to me. This basically means that if you were to buy this stock today, you would pay $121 for every dollar you could expect to earn. I did a quick Google search for the average P.E. in the NASDAQ, and it's about 24. That means that Match Group is almost five times more expensive than the average stock trading in the same exchange. Now I'll switch over to their investor relations homepage to go more in depth. They have some reasons why you should invest listed here. They have 16.2 million paying customers. That also seems low to me as a global brand. They claim that 60% of all relationships started on a dating app started on a match group brand, but that's based on an internal survey so I don't know how accurate those numbers are. Some quick highlights from their financials. Revenue grew 24% year over year, however, operating costs grew 31% year over year and make up 71% of revenue. Current assets total $1.2 billion, but current liabilities total $1.1 billion, so there's not a large margin for error there. In the three months ended December 31st, 2021, they lost $0.60 cents a share, however, as previously mentioned, earnings were $0.93 cents per share for the entire year. Now I'll move on to the technical side, pulling up a daily chart from Match Group and you can see along the bottom they've missed 6 out of the last 7 earnings. Match was trading in a channel until December of 2021 and has been declining ever since. I have a level of interest drawn at around $91 a share and another one around $47 a share. I would definitely expect price to decline down to $91 and at that point maybe it bounces and maybe it doesn't. In all honesty though, I see a ton of downside for this stock. I didn't see a lot or really any positives on the fundamental or technical side. Short term, I would expect share price to decline to that $91 level we just talked about, a decline of about 20%. Long term, at a PE ratio of over 100 and with costs growing faster than revenue, this stock is a ticking time bomb. This is not a recommendation to go short it, but personally, I wouldn't touch it with a 39 and a half foot pole. If you guys enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below and let me know which stock you want me to review next time. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.